In this short video, I'm going to show you how to add an announcement bar in Wix. Doing so through Wix is possible, however, it can be quite time consuming and confusing for beginners. So I'm going to show you a much easier, free and quick way to do it. The first thing I want you to do is to click the first link in the description of this video, which will take you to the elfside.com website. It looks just like this. From here, what you want to do is go ahead and hover over the widgets button right here. Then from here, I want you to go to e-commerce, which is right here. And then right beneath it, you will see announcement bar. Click on announcement bar and then simply create widget for free. Click on this button right here. And then this will take you to your announcement bar template. As you can see, there's a bunch of different templates that you can choose from. Don't worry about the overall content or the design of the template. This is all uh, customizable, which I'm going to show you how to do in just a second. In my case, I'm going to go for a news announcement bar, which is the default one right here. Simply uh, click on continue with this template once you've chosen the one that you want to go for. And then this is where we can customize pretty much anything to do with the announcement bar itself. As you can see, we are proud to announce blah, blah, blah. This is the label. We can change the contents of it just like this. And then you have a button here that says read more. You can, of course, change that. And then you can add a link uh, to where the button goes. Once people click on it, uh, you can add a visual element, additional settings right here and a bunch of other things like that regarding the content. Then you also have the positioning. So if you want it to be static top, which is uh, which is what it is right now, you can do that. You can also do floating top. You can do floating bottom right here, or you can do inline, which would be kind of like in the middle of the screen. We want to do static top. Then style, you can make it bigger or smaller like this. Uh, then the bar size, large, small, medium, bunch of things like that. I'm not going to get into every setting, by the way, because this will make the video very long. So I'll just leave this up to you to kind of customize. And then once you're happy with the way it looks, what you want to do is click add to website for free at the bottom here. And then this is going to automatically create the announcement bar widget for you. Now, before you get to the screen right here, it will ask you to log in. In this case, you have two options. You can either create an account straight for the uh, platform itself, or you can use your Google account to log in, uh, which is what I've done because it's quick and easy. So once you've done that and you're all logged in, click on publish in the top right corner of the screen right here. And then the last thing we need to do is select a plan. Since this is the first widget we're using from the Elf site platform, uh, we can go for the free plan right here, which supports a single widget. However, in the future, if you do decide to use multiple of the widgets, because they have a lot of them that are also really good, um, you will have to opt for one of the premium plans right here. But for now, we're going to go for the free plan. Click on select and then give it a couple of seconds. And then as you can see, this is the code for our announcement bar widget. Click copy code right here. And then let's go back to our Wix website. And then what we need to do here is head over to the Wix editor. And then in the top right corner of the screen, click on the search bar right here. Then search for HTML. And once the search results load up, click on embed, which should be near the top. Then on the left-hand side, you will see a new menu open up. From here, underneath popular embeds, you will see embed HTML. Click on this, and this is going to add an HTML box right to your Wix website. From here, all you have to do is paste the code that we just copied, and then click on update. And then within a few seconds, your announcement bar will be added to your Wix website. From here, all you have to do is simply position the announcement bar wherever you want, and then leave it at that. As you can see, I've already gone on the top here, but, so I'm not going to touch it. But yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to add an announcement bar in Wix. If you have any questions, please let me know down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to help you out.